When you think of the word focus, you can think about terms such as your directed attention, a point of concentration, or even an attraction. And as Christians and believers of Christ, we have to understand that our focus controls our mindset. Well, what do I mean? We can go to the book of Matthew chapter 14, verse 22 through 32, and we understand that Peter was walking on water and how he began to walk towards Jesus. And the Bible declares that Peter began to sink. Well, if Jesus told him to walk and to come, and walk on water why did he sink he began to sink because he took his focus off of what really mattered he took his focus off of Jesus and he began to focus on what was happening or what was going on around him and it is so imperative and it is so profound that in the time and in the season that we're living in, you cannot lose focus. Because I believe that God is about to open the realms of heaven and pour out blessings upon his people that if your attention is elsewhere, you can miss it. And I don't know who I'm talking to, but there's somebody who's focused on something that you need to give to God. Because people of God, you have to understand that the ultimate plan of the enemy is to clog your vision or to keep you distracted from what God really has for you. Because the enemy me know was that if you keep your focus on God, then he has something to worry about. That's why the enemy constantly tells you that you're never going to be anything because he really sees how valuable you really are. The enemy always tells you that you're going to be broke, but the truth of the matter is he really sees wealth upon you. But if he can keep your focus off of God, then he can keep you in that place of stagnation and that place of going nowhere. But you have to understand that your focus is your key to prevail into your destiny. People of God, you can't lose your focus. There's so much that God has in store for you. You just need to stay committed, stay focused on what God has told you. The promises that he placed inside your heart shall come to pass if you don't give up. But you shall, you shall, you shall reach what God has for you. And I pray that you all were encouraged. I pray that I touched somebody today. It wasn't long. I just felt the need to say something. I hope you guys are blessed by it and yeah. Bye.